This is Darius from therabbitpad.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can check the edit history of your Google Docs. Also note that this same process can work in Google Sheets and Google Slides. So I have a document here with some random text, and let's suppose I want to track the changes that I've made over time. What you do is you click on File, and then you click on Version History. You have the option of naming the current version, but we'll worry about that later. In order to see the history, you're going to click see version history. And then this column will open up here on the right, showing you the different versions of the document. Since the only person who's edited this document is me, only my name will appear. But if you have a shared document with other people, their edits will also show in this column. And let's say I want to see what the original version of this document looked like. I can click the earliest one and it'll show a blank screen. And then if I want to see what the document looked like when text was added, I could click on the second one and so forth. You can also name different versions of the file. So if you wanted to name this Wednesday, you could do that. And you can also restore previous versions of edited documents as well. You can do that by clicking this blue box here in the upper left, or you can click these three dots and then select restore this version. So if you want to restore a previous version of this document, just click on that. Then this box will appear and it will revert the document to that version. So if you are sure you do not want the latest information in that file and you want to restore it to a previous time, then click restore and then that document will look the way it did at that time. If you just want to make a copy of a previous version, you can also do that by clicking on these three dots, then clicking and make a copy and then it will ask you where to store that copy. So this video shows you how to view the edit history of documents in Google Docs. And remember, this also applies in Google Sheets and Google Slides. If you found this video helpful, please click that like button and subscribe to this channel to view more helpful videos in the future. Also, please be sure to visit my website at therabbitpad.com.